to my OSX86 projects. Well, today in the hot seat I have a Acer E machine. It's the E720. It's a very nice machine that I want straight to my brand new Samsung uh, S1 phone that I got for my provider. But <laughs> I was scared at that time that the thing would fall out of my hand and that it would just break. So I traded it to this laptop at that time it's some years ago just think of when the Samsung S1 came out you know and I traded it to this laptop and this laptop gave me a real nice time because um, of course it's a great Windows machine it's a great Linux machine but it's also a great Mac and I used to you know test Mac for a long time on this machine but I'm back and uh, as you can see if you install a Mac OS X86, you must always look here in the corner. If you see that, you see a little Wi-Fi sign there, means you should not select any text, means that the Wi-Fi is already found. Okay, so let's customize. We're going to select this drive here. There we go. And we're going to do some customizing. Because we're installing uh, the iAdcos L2. Here you can see it. On this machine we're gonna choose for bootloader chameleon graphics enabler built-in Ethernet you need that for the App Store so make sure it's selected uh, custom kernels well you know I'm not gonna use any kernel here drivers as you see uh, the list is way smaller but on the drivers we will find on the main hardware SATA IDE go for the for the first one AHCI SATA this one here okay and uh, we continue the list for sound I would just go for uh, Voodoo uh, 2.6 is just a good one works fine USB uh, we have no USB 3 but you must select USB here the hardware sensors in fact you could select um, the CPU and the motherboard uh, this is this does not have an NVIDIA card. It has an Intel card PS2 laptop battery VGA there we go This is very important what we're gonna do now because as you can see there's no driver for this card here you see that This has an Intel card the Intel uh, I think the 4500 So I have in fact no um, No, no nothing here. So I just selected uh, graphics enabler in here and we must just you know see if that will be enough to work in here you can see that we have only the Atheris but we're not gonna select anything because we already have um, yeah a working internet here so this is it for this machine we're gonna hit OK and then install and then you know after this is done at the next reboot then I will get back to you and then we'll see uh, yeah, if I made the right choices. Okay, let's cross our fingers, peeps. She just... Uh, this is the first reboot. So we're just going to hit enter. Just, just see what's going to happen. And I like this. Although the apple is not round, so I think we have a problem with the with the screen. The screen is not 100%. I installed Narash, and Narash was working just fine on here. But uh, I had a problem with um, uh, with the screen. At a certain moment, I did find the text, and in fact, I wiped it now. So I should go download it again although I have it on the other machine and what that was the 30 the 30 the 3100 kext for this machine and then the resolution was good and I had a good resolution but everything was looking really weird you could not read good and it was strange so I just deleted the system and I went for I at cost this time because I at cost is also a friend of mine from Turkey and he sent me this uh, CD not so long ago well it was a while ago also a year ago about the same time that I received uh, the Narash CD hey and there we go there we go it's working 
but it works fine, yo. Um, yeah, I uh, was about to install Linux on this machine, but then I thought, hey, it still has the old Apple sign, so let's let's see if the I it costs if I can get it to work, you know, and it's working just fine. I did change the uh, AirPod card into the Atheros card from uh, old MacBook that I still had lying around, so I took out the Wi-Fi card. I think the Wi-Fi card that was in here. I don't well I don't see it here YouTube. okay peeps I'm not gonna make this video any longer you already know how it works I'm gonna do some uh, updates checking I'm not gonna do no OS updates so I'm not gonna upgrade this thing I'm just gonna leave it like this show you the specifications one more time because I don't even know if I showed you the specifications here it is 10.7.2 is lion lion 2 and uh, here you can see it's 2.16 gigahertz intel core core 2 duo so this thing has the same processor like this macbook pro in fact you know <laughs> but this macbook pro is running 10.68 because it runs better on the macbook pro it doesn't get so hot you see i have nice temperatures 41 degrees but i also have these big channels air channels in my in my filter there I have a video showing that by the way how to do that and how to keep your Mac like really cool even when <laughs> when you're editing so uh, yeah this was my video peeps if you think this video was cool it was about the e-machine e720 uh, MacBook if you think this video was cool of course you must not forget to like and of course to subscribe to my channel and I say stay safe out there until my next video bye bye